So how was I able to generate nearly $12,000 in the past week or so just using Instagram marketing? And I think I got one. What's up guys, it's Sebastian and welcome back to another video. Today I'm so excited. This video is going to be so full of value. I'm gonna give you guys the complete guide Instagram marketing. In comparison to Facebook and Google, Instagram is so much easier to make sales. So for just a couple minutes, I'm gonna talk about what exactly Instagram marketing is and then I'm actually gonna give you guys an example. I'm gonna go through the process live and show you exactly what I do and the tools that I use to find influencers that, you know, that are legit, the ones that I know will make me money and the ones that I know aren't gonna scam me and it's going to be a great time. You guys are gonna learn a lot, so make sure you drop a like, and let's just get right into it. So, what is influencer marketing? Well, basically, think about it like this. You have a page revolving around something very, very niche, like traveling, or like tropical places in the earth, tropical islands. Okay, so what you can do is you could find these pages, and you could see if they have engagements, right? You could see if they're getting a lot of likes, and I'll show you guys exactly how to do this later on in the video, but you could see if they're getting a lot of likes, a lot of comments, a lot of interest, and then you could build a store around that page and then advertise on that page. So for example, if we're using a tropical store, right? If we find a tropical influencer and he just has insane engagements, right? 10%, you know, he's getting thousands and thousands of likes and people love his page and they comment, we could go and we could find a product from AliExpress that has something to do with tropical or something to do with a Hawaiian or anything in that general you know, area and then bring it onto our store, create a nice little promotion, you know, 25% off, 30% off, free plus shipping, something like that. You know, have a cool picture, DM the person that we find and say, hey, I would love to advertise. I have a tropical category on my store. Let's make some money together. And then you obviously pay him. He'll post your picture for 24 hours with the link in his bio, or he'll tag your store Instagram. And then you get a bunch of people that are interested in Hawaii or a bunch of people that are interested in tropical islands come onto your store and then they see that page. You know, they see those products and they're like, oh my God, I love tropical stuff. I'm gonna buy all this stuff. That's pretty much what Instagram marketing is in a nutshell. It's super simple. It does not take long at all. And like I said, in comparison to all the other platforms, it's so much easier, which is why I preach in my course, especially always, always start with Instagram. Shameless plug. If you guys want the course, link in the description, save a hundred bucks right now. Anyway, guys, I'm going to jump into the computer. I'm going to just stop rambling. I'm going to show you guys exactly what I do to find an influencer that I know will make me money so I can buy my GTR. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in there. Okay. So here we are on Instagram and I'm going to use the exact same example as before, just a Hawaii themed page. I'm going to pretend that I have a Hawaii subcategory on my store. So I'm literally going to type in Hawaii and we'll see what comes up. So we'll just, we'll click on the first page. Um, and so they have 114,000 followers. Let's see how many likes you're getting. 4,000 likes on that first post. We'll go a little bit further. 4,500, 5,000. Look, advertisement right here. Advertisement right here. These people probably just DM'd them and said, hey, I you know, wanna, you wanna uh, advertise my wave ring. But this is exactly what I was saying before, like a wave ring, that's something to do with tropical, right? When you go to a tropical island, obviously it's an island, there's gonna be waves, right? Or so people that are into tropical islands and like, you know, being on the beach and like the waves and whatever, exactly what I'm saying. Look, wave ring, this person or this drop shipper knows how to target people. And I'm sure that he made a lot of money from this. Now, this is a pretty decent page for only 114,000 followers to be getting this amount of likes is really good. So the first thing I would do is I would check their engagements. And then after that, there's a bunch of other stuff that I do to make sure that the influencer is good before I use them. So how do you check the engagements? Just copy copy this, control C, and then take it over to this website here, okay? Just type in, I'm not gonna even try to pronounce it. Just take it over to this website, go to platform, go to engagement calculator, and we can literally just paste it here and click search. And they're gonna be pretty high, yeah. So 4% is good. You want anywhere from three to 5%. If you are desperate, like, and you can't find a page at all, you could kind of dip into 2%, but three to 5% is good, you know, it means green light, you can go ahead and, and possibly even post with them. So, so far so good. We'll go back and let's just look at some comments. So we'll go ahead and view all. Beautiful, paradise, okay, emojis. Hawaii is amazing sunset. Yeah, I love Hawaii, hope to return. So these are all real people, right? These are all real comments. These aren't just, uh, this isn't just like an engagement group where it's like nice, top, you know, this is a nice one, classy. They're not one all one worded stuff. 
So these are real people, which is good. And obviously this influencer is a green light so far. I would use this influencer if I was doing something tropical. So another thing I do is I go to their followers and then I look for the ones that have profile pictures, right? Because if they have a follower that doesn't have a profile picture, it's likely that it's a bot because if, if it's a real person on Instagram, then they're gonna wanna change their profile picture, right? They're gonna wanna have at least something different. You know, most of the time, if they don't, then it's not gonna be a real person. And if this page is just flooded with people that don't have profile pictures, you'd probably want to stay away. But look, there's literally, okay, so there's one, two, we'll scroll down a little bit longer, two so far, three right there. That's nothing. Like I'm talking, if, if half of these or a third of these were, no profile pictures, then that'd be a red flag. But these are literally all real people. I found three in like a group of 50 or more. I don't even know how many I went through, but obviously there's gonna be some that don't have a profile picture, but for the most part, if like 80 to 90% do, you should be pretty good. So yeah, this is a decent page. You know, it's small. I would start by advertising on this page. So how do we find other pages? Once we find a good page, how do we find other pages like that? Well, there's this very, very powerful tool called the arrow right here, and you just click it and it gives you related pages. So Naked Hawaii, I don't wanna click on that one because something might come up, but we'll just go to Hawaii tag and see what comes up. So 20, uh, personally, not enough followers. I wouldn't, I wouldn't mess with it, so we'll just go back. Go back to the related pages, we can exit that one out. 58 followers, not enough. So let's go ahead and try to find another one. Let's try Hawaii Magazine. 112 followers, so same as last time. Uh, the engagements are a little bit less on this one, so the other page would actually be better. Oh, this was a big one. Yeah, the other page, I'd probably go with the other page over this one. So we'll go back. Let's try to find one with more followers. Okay, so I just clicked on the Naked Hawaii and there's no naked people on it, so that's good. And they actually have 400,000 followers. So let's see what their engagements are. 3,000, 5,000, 4,000. Here's that wave ring again, 16K. Okay, that was a big one, 14K. So once again, let's go ahead and copy this, throw it in the engagement calculator and see what we get. This one is 2%. So the last one was a lot better, right? Um, for the amount of followers, cause you know, this, this person has four times as many followers, but for the amount of followers, that person was doing really, really good. The first page that we went on. Nevertheless, this page is still getting a lot of likes. So I would still advertise with it. Um, just because they have lower engagements, they're still getting a lot of likes. I would just, you know, even though it's 2%, I think that I would still go ahead and advertise with it. And then, you know, once again, let's let's click on this advertisement. We could even read through some of these comments. Just ordered one, love it. Shipping to America, you know, love it. Naked white, yeah, guys, just ordered mine. I, guys, this person made money for sure. This person made money, okay, he's smart. He found a Hawaii Island, you know, page, a tropical page, and then advertised a somewhat tropical product, right? You only find waves on islands by a body of water, and that's all these islands are about. Oceans, waters, animals, look at all these pictures, they're all water. This guy was smart. So you guys have to do this. Find pages related to your products and advertise. I guarantee you that guy 5x his money on this page. And so it's really that simple, guys. It really, really is. Like you saw that picture. It's not even anything. He just found a picture and that's it. And you guys could use this tag, use this tool, I mean, and you could just continue to find you know, pictures for, for days. Tour Hawaii. Look, here's another one. 7,000, 6,000, 8,000. Oh my goodness, what are the engagements on this? For only 150,000 followers, guys. This is insane. Hold on, let's copy this. So 4.3%, even better, guys. Here's another page, just DM them. You know, where's that? The wavering isn't even on this page. It's so simple. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, I don't really use any other tools. I go through their followers, make sure they don't have any profile pictures, anything sketchy like that. I make sure their engagements are at least three to 5%, if not any higher. And um, you know, even if you see advertisements on that page, that's good. You know, if you see multiple advertisements, that's good because they're making money. All right, so if you guys made it to this point, Point in the video, you have to do me a favor. I know that you were interested. I know that you at least learned something or got some sort of value. So go ahead and drop a like down below right now. And if you're new to the channel and you've gotten to this far, also click subscribe because we're growing so fast. The channel recently blew up. We're getting hundreds of subs a day in comparison to we used to be getting like 20 to 30 a day. Now we're getting hundreds. Just go ahead and get on the train right now, guys. Um, but yeah, I'll see you all in the next video. I can't wait. I have so much value coming out. So you guys all stay tuned. Make sure you also turn on those notifications. And uh, once again, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out. And I think I got one.
Yeah, and I think I got one.